Welcome back and uh, with us is uh, uh, our uh, dear guest engineer Walid Kamal is a member of the uh, uh, en uh, engineer Kuwaiti engineer uh, company and uh, um, of course talking about uh, celebrating Labor Day and at the same time uh, the president inaugurated uh, uh, a very huge uh, project the uh, here company and uh, here Egypt complex for electric um, appliances in the tent of Ramadan city how do you observe uh, this rapid progress in uh, development w when it comes to development of uh, industry and uh, electrical appliances, which is a leap uh, in almost more than 30 years? We haven't had that leap, particularly yes. in the manufacture of electrical uh, um, uh, uh, industry. So uh, talk to us about the inauguration of that particular complex by the president in the tent of Ramadan city and how important is that project uh, to uh, our uh, economy? Uh, firstly, I would like to thank you for this invitation. Very good morning. Uh, uh, this is uh, the focus and the target of the new period. A new period we focus for labor development mm. and for opening and new opportunities especially for our experiences which exported to uh, outside. Uh, now the country is in progress with uh, many projects and uh, all projects, a uh, third or near to half of projects investors go mm -hmm. for electrical application like wiring, communication, data, power station, uh, solar energy, all even houses, all uh, infrastructure bridges need electrical appliance. Uh, mm. uh, in fact, for we export all of this from uh, some uh, other countries, mm. then we pay uh, with their uh, own uh, hard coins, like we pay for Egyptian dollar, for Euro, and this affect the flotation and the, our Egyptian pound. Of our currency, so, of course. Uh, uh, stabilize such industries in Egypt, one mm. of the biggest important target to minimize export side. Mm. Meanwhile, we employ our of course, the labor force. Then we export this appliance. Mm. Also, Egypt have a lot of resources, like uh, white silicons, like uh, mining activities, which metals. We need metals. We have plastics from petrochemical company came from Egyptian gases. So once you have such complexes. You utilize your national resources, more employment, more export, more hard coins to the country. Right. That's very important. You raised three important points, of course. You talked about empowering the labor force. You talked about the natural resources or the resources that we have gathered over the years. And at the same time, increasing our exports, which means uh, the venues. Uh, yes, I mean, exactly. Expanding our venues. So uh, uh, how could all these three objectives be fulfilled by this particular complex in the tenth of Ramadan? Seems like it's a vital one. Yes, exactly. The tenth of Ramadan city, one of the biggest industrial city all over Egypt and mm. Middle East. And now uh, tenth of Ramadan is one of the ways all investors came from Europe, from China, from uh, Middle East, from GC countries to stabilize their industries here. And this will uh, be a good message for other investors to come for new cities. Mm. For th this is just example. We are succeed in one factory. If we succeed in the next one, two years in such factories, many of exporters whom go to China, to go other countries, will uh, uh, make their operations here in Egypt and they will come uh, after the stabilization they see and the political and security issues which Egypt lead in that area. Mm. Uh, talking about the hair uh, uh, complex that was integrated by the president, of course, uh, from uh, what you're saying, we could uh, uh, understand that it, it is going to change the map of uh, electric, uh, electrical uh, appliances industry in Egypt. Yes, uh, exactly. We're going for renewable energy and the world is going mm. for a climate change. Mm. So electric uses will increase us mm. and the oil fuels and such uh, emission uh, products which can will delay it. Mm. So electricity 
uh, one of the industries which will grow up, especially now, we uh, uh, convert cars to electric. We convert uh, handling equipment in factories to mm -hmm. electric. Uh, even the solar energy wiring, uh, which came from the solar itself to the uh, electric unit to the houses, mm -hmm. will be electric. So uh, there is a, a good progress uh, to this industry. Yes. But some say that it's going to be much more costly. So, do you think it's going to expand the course when we are shifting or moving uh, to, uh, um, I mean, renewable energy, or it's going to limit the course? Uh, cost is calculated, and ROI, return of invest, will come through this. So, uh, uh, return of invest uh, calculated, and. Uh, in, in electric energy and solar energy, we calculate the cost after. If we invest, for example, one million uh, Egyptian bound in electric car, mm -hmm. after uh, five years, ten years, without paying for fuel to for other petrol petrol material, uh, we will save our money. So it's dependent on ROI for the project. So on the long run, it's going to be minimized of the cost. Yes, but Other we things. should take care about the labor. Mm. because uh, the just transition to labor because mm. this will affect labor so the united nation as well and this one of the uh, united nation uh, framework for climate change focused the just transition that mm. some people need to be replaced to other uh, industries because mm. electric use decrease uh, uh, decrease the labor use so mm. for example the automatic control system and factories uh, before, if you have a one plant, for example, oil processing plant, you need 10 operators to run one unit. Today, mm -hmm. with the SCADA system, SCADA is a supervision control and data acquisition systems, mm -hmm. minimize by two person, one in field, one in control room, you can minimize the size. Mm -hmm. So we have to focus more, not just for uh, land labor or uh, normal skills or mid-skill labors. We should mm -hmm. upgrade our labors, our technical schools, our uh, engineering uh, frameworks mm. to upgrade the level of our operators, technician, engineers to work with the new technologies. Mm. Then we export these skills outside mm. and then we return it back by hard coin and uh, more uh, uh, euro, dollars, some coins we mm. need to invest in other projects. That's amazing. But also, uh, besides, I mean, uh, all that uh, m minimizing the hazards of climate change, the carbon emission, all the uh, dangerous outcome, uh, I mean, uh, results that come from uh, the uh, excessive climate change that President Abdel Fattah Sisi have been working on and on for years, almost 10 years now, to mm -hmm. warn the whole uh, Arab region and the world from it. Almost in every speech, he used to war, warn um, countries of the, the hazards of climate change. I mean, uh, impl implementing uh, these plans and these policies is going to lessen the dangers of climate change. Exactly. Yes. Right. It will decrease, but also have value at long-term operations. Mm. Uh, all companies or organizations, they invest in climate change four or five years ago. Now they are in good point. Mm. For example, for the carbon calculation or carbon bank, carbon emissions calculation. Mm. Now, carbon point will be calculated through the carbon mm. certificate. The, ca the, the companies who have carbon certificates, they, they are work with carbon footprint uh, level. They can sell their carbon point to other company. For example, mm. Mm. if the new electric appliance company in 10th of Ramadan work with carbon for footprint, and other country plant working with fuel oil or war gases. If the calculated emissions here become more, our factory can sell the carbon footprint point to other countries. Mm. So all investors and financial adaptation mm. for the uh, new uh, energy or uh, modern uh, energy techniques which would work with climate change uh, and saving uh, uh, fuels and emission gases become a invest mm. and you can calculate it if we do it from five years ago mm. what invest now so we go fast tracking
also uh, uh, take the uh, good chances from other countries who work with carbon footprint uh, uh, to, to copy factory. experiences yes and also it's going to enable us to make a clean shift to green economy exactly which is the language of uh, uh,